Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. Time right now, 717 on your Wednesday morning, and I think we all know that we've had a wild summer thus far, and we're hoping that we can turn a corner, Pat. Yeah. And it's not just for us. I mean, everywhere, Massachusetts, yeah. wildfire smoke impacting all of us. Yeah. It's been busy across the entire Northeast. Thankfully, we've got a little bit of a break in the action today, but it does not last. We have some more rain in store later in the week, but you can enjoy some sunshine today, mainly in the afternoon and evening temperatures getting to the upper 70s and low 80s. It comes with a breeze out of the Northwest about 5 to 15 miles per hour. So that'll help bring in some drier air from Canada and it'll knock the humidity levels down quite a bit for the rest of today. So it's dry for Wednesday, but on Thursday, scattered thunderstorms do return in the afternoon. Doesn't look like much of a severe thunderstorm threat and the risk for flooding will be low because these storms will be moving along pretty quickly. And after a dry Friday, rain chances come back once again for the weekend. Not so much on Saturday, but especially Sunday could turn out to be on the wet side. So yesterday's system is lifting out of Maine. We're left much drier in its wake. Plenty of clouds and a few lingering showers this morning, but generally dry in northern uh, New York and northern Vermont. Temperatures are starting off in the 50s and low and mid 60s, already close to 70 in the upper valley. But here's the big difference you'll notice as you're stepping out the door, much lower dew points. I actually watched the evening news last night and there were a lot of upper 60s and low 70s on this map. Dew points back in the 50s are so much more comfortable and you'll really notice that throughout the day today. So the clouds will leave, we'll end the day partly to mostly sunny. And then first thing tomorrow morning, we're still fairly bright. No rain to worry about in the morning, but the clouds will steadily fill in as the day goes on. We've got this broken line of showers and thunderstorms that arrive in northern New York right around 3, 4 o'clock in the afternoon. They'll push into the Champlain Valley in the following hours, so we're expecting a pretty wet evening commute tomorrow. Some of these storms uh, could have some heavy rain, briefly uh, getting some towns to a half inch to an inch of rain. But it does get out of here pretty quickly. We're left with a much drier Friday with lots of sunshine before we look ahead to more wet weather over the weekend. We do have the impact icon there on Thursday because uh, if you're driving around tomorrow evening, it might get a little bit tough as the rain comes down heavily. Other than a few morning showers for Friday, we're looking pretty good. Some showers possible on Saturday. I think the rain chance goes up late in the day, leading us into the wet Sunday. All throughout, temperatures staying in the mid to upper 70s and low 80s. Back to you.